What's up YouTube? Chris with Murphy Firearms training another short barrel ballistics test out of a carry gun. I have got the Ruger LCP. This is the LCP Custom. Taller sights, red anodized trigger. Otherwise, it's the LCP-1. 2.75 inch barrel. And I am going to be shooting the ARX Copper Polymer. This is a solid sort of plastic uh, matrix projectile. That's what it's called. I'll show it to you. If I can get one out of the box here. It's this weird... It's a solid, looks like a round nose, got these little grooves cut into it. Got these little grooves cut into it. So that's what it looks like. Uh, the information on the box, here it is. It is a 56 grain, 56 grain projectile. Says it is traveling 1,260 feet per second with a muzzle energy of 197 foot pounds. I will put the average velocity in the comments to this video. We are going to shoot this with the chronograph and see what we get. So we're gonna chronograph this ammo, see what we get for velocity. I will put velocity and energy in the comments. Then we're gonna shoot some water jugs and we're gonna shoot some pine boards and see the hard barrier penetration. So, chronograph, here we go. This is the ARX chronograph readings. Eleven fifty-five. 1174, 1183, 1162, 1173, 1159, 1182, and we are clear. The LCP doesn't lock open on the last shot. Seven clean chronograph readings all all near that 1200 mark that's not bad let's go set up the water jug test arx projectile water jug test out of the 380 lcp not bad not bad all right we're clear all right so we threw the first jug off of the bench let's find it there's our entry wound there is our exit wound. So, entry and exit. One jug. Jug number two. Entry there. Exit there. Looks like it's curving just a little bit. I don't believe there's a projectile in there. We're going to set that to the side. Don't believe there's a projectile because there is hit number three. And it smacked the back of that jug pretty hard. Uh, did we lose it? Did we lose it? That's the question. Let's check. We did not. Down in here is a projectile. So let's get it out and see what we got. I expect no deformation from this projectile. Didn't get a ton of splash from it. There it is. Let's dig it out here. So there's our projectile. And let me throw water jugs is fun anyway. So there's our projectile, folks. Totally um, undeformed. That's pretty much how it looks in the case. Nothing, nothing changed there. There's your 380 projectile. Um, you know, if you're really concerned with penetration, I mean, that got three full jugs. It punched a hole in the back of the third jug, so that penetrated three full jugs of water. I mean, they're six and a half inches a piece, guys. You can do the math. I mean, that's pretty much 19 and a half inches of penetration. And uh, I don't know what that equates to in ballistics gel, but I like to see every hollow point I carry go through two jugs and stop in the third or go through three and stop in the fourth. And that's pretty good for a short barrel 380. So now we're going to set it up with a pine board test and we're going to see how it does against a hard barrier. So pine decking boards here. These are one inch thick treated pine decking boards. And we're going to take a shot at those and see what we get. ARX pine board test. Here we go. All right, we got our first hit. Let's see what happened. In and out, busted through. Hit number two. Oh, I see some like stippling around that. That's interesting. Hit number two is in there and out there. So two full boards. 
And she hit the third board really hard. Wow, I'm going to dig that out. Hit that third board really hard. Almost. Didn't make a mark on the back. Almost went through the third board. And there sits our projectile. And other than covered in sawdust, no worse for the wear. You could probably reload that. So, all right. Two boards and into the third. So there you go. All right, so that is the ARX Matrix self-defense bullet. It is not a hollow point, a copper polymer bullet. So an interesting, interesting sort of bullet. Um, you know, for this small caliber, if your concern is penetration, you're worried about penetration, this might be the bullet for you. Anyway, there it is, guys. You make the decision. If you enjoy short-barreled tests like this, give us a like, subscribe, let us know what you want to see, leave your questions in the comments, and we appreciate your support. Thanks, guys.